These technologies can be incredibly engaging for children, which has an upside and a potential downside. We've technologized childhood in a way that's really unprecedented. A lot of people refer today to children being uh, digital natives because they're born into digital technology. They're immersed in it beginning at about three or four months of age. And their parents are often digital immigrants because many parents today came to technology later in life. So it creates a lot of parenting challenges for parents who grew up without a lot of these technologies trying to figure out how to integrate those into young children's lives. What's the importance of giving parents direction on how they can use these devices in their child's lives? It's immensely important. Every interaction a baby has or a toddler has lays neural connections in their mind. And those connections really lay the groundwork for all of their uh, future learning. Preschool children spend about four and a half hours a day today with digital media. They're only awake for about 12 hours a day, so they're spending a third of their time in front of a screen of some kind. So the important thing for parents to do is one, to minimize that amount of time, to keep it at a healthy amount, but then also to really focus a lot on the content and the nature of the experience. With the advent of these touchscreen technologies, it created this kind of contingent uh, response, right? The screen does something when you touch it. The child is doing something. It's incredibly gratifying. It's captivating. We found that the typical child will play with their favorite toy 20 to 30 minutes a day, but they'll play with an iPad for much, much longer. If my research is successful, then children will lead healthy lives in a digital world.